The final rush is on in campaign 2018. We are less than 24 hours away from the polls opening. In Massachusetts, candidates are pushing for last minute votes. Well, it seems many people have already cast their ballots. WBZ's Michelle Fisher has more from the State House. Campaign 2018 has been long. I will be happy when we're at Wednesday. <laughs> but it's not over yet. From gubernatorial candidates to those running for Senate, local politicians are trying to get last minute support from voters. The weekend was spent rallying and canvassing. For 18 months we've been campaigning and traveling the whole state, hitting every corner, every city, every town. But now, you know, with Tuesday, the election day, I mean, it's right around the corner. The enthusiasm keeps driving up and up. And we're doing the thing that matters the most. We're in this room to fight for democracy. Governor Baker made a stop in Hyde Park ahead of Election Day Eve. And we set a tone where people really do believe that we are trying to do what's best for the people of Massachusetts and not just playing games and, and party politics. Baker's Democratic opponent had a similar message from Springfield. I will stand up for every single person in this state. I will see you and hear you. During a press conference today, state officials provided an update on voter turnout. We expect about 585,000 persons to have voted early, which we're very pleased about. With more and more people casting their ballots earlier, some voters question if all the last minute canvassing really makes much of a difference at all. It's, that isn't going to influence me. You know, I've already voted and I had already set, decided on my mind. I probably have tuned out a lot of the campaigning at this point because it's the same messages over and over and over. So nobody's going to say anything I haven't heard. A projected 2.4 million people are expected to vote by the time polls close at 8 tomorrow night. They open at 7 in the morning. At the State House, Michelle Fisher, WBZ News.